Hey guys, what is up? I have got an easy little project going today. What I have in front of me are the Creative Options plastic organizers, and I think these have kind of become the de facto um, storage solution for loose die cast cars. Uh, they work great, they're cheap, they're readily available. I get these at Hobby Lobby. Uh, these were $9. I think they've gone up to $10. But yeah, so they're relatively inexpensive. They're the right size for the most part. And uh, they work really well. But there's a problem. An annoyance. So I'll open this up. All the cars in here fit really well. But you'll notice there's this weird compartment right here. And you say, well, it's not that weird. You just put a longer vehicle in there. But the problem is the longer vehicles, let's say a team transport vehicle, well, it doesn't, it doesn't fit, right? It's too, it's not tall enough. So it's, it's not tall enough for a long vehicle and it's too wide, you know, for a, a small vehicle because it bounces around. And if you put two in here, which is what most people do, they just shove two cars in there. Well, if they're nice, they're going to bang into each other and it's going to mess up the paint. Typically what I do with this weird compartment is I either don't use it at all, like you see here, um, or I shove cars in there that are all beat up. That's like the, the typical solution, you know, or it bugs me that I got this car banging around in there. I would rather have two cars and have the extra storage and have a divide. Hey guys, I'm gonna need to cut in here for just a second because I was describing my plan and I just got way off track. So what we're gonna do today is we are going to fix this problem. And the way we're going to do it is with 3D modeling and 3D printing. So the first thing I need to do is get some accurate measurements of the space we're trying to fill. Then we're going to go into Fusion 360 and we're going to create a 3D model of an object that will fit in that compartment and divide it in two and pretty much make it like all the other compartments in the storage container. Uh, once I have the model done, we'll go over to the 3D printer, we'll print it out, and we might have to iterate a few times to get one that fits just right. So yeah, that is what I'm working on right now. So just kick back, we'll finish this part of the project, and then uh, once I have something to show you, well, I'll show you. Okay guys, um, let me show you where we're at with this. Uh, I have done some printing and I've done some revisions and I think we're at a good spot. With the video you just saw of me working up this object in Fusion, well this was the first version of our divider. This worked pretty well, but the dimensions were a little bit off and the whole thing is just a little bit, f a little bit uh, floppy. So I wanted the part to be a little bit more rigid and of course I had to adjust the dimensions. So uh, we made another one. So this piece is a much, much more rigid than the first one, but the dimensions were also just a little bit off by like a half a centimeter in a couple spots. So once I tested that, we got this boy. And I'm gonna call this one my final revision. Pretty happy with how this fits. I'm pretty happy with the structure of it. And yeah, it just slides right in. And they fit, they fit just fine. They fit like any other of the uh, storage compartments. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna call this a successful project. We're all done. Now the only thing left to do is print enough of these to go in all my cases. All right guys, I think we are ready to wrap this one up. 
Well, I am very happy with how this project has turned out. I'm, I'm able to get full value out of these little storage boxes. The divider that I've made is a quick and easy print. And you know what? It really works great as well. If you're after this file, I will put a link in the description. It's a free download and, as I said, a very easy print. And guys, I think it's time for me to roll on out of here. I hope you enjoyed the video. And you know what? I'll catch you next time. Okay, y'all take care.